Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to learn about invoking report definition through activity and important parameters to be passed. Basically we know that report definition is useful to pull some records from a database and we can play around uh, with many options provided in report definition. But how to invoke that? From a database we can just directly invoke. To invoke from the activity you have to use this px retrieve report data. So if I go here and check the options, I can see these parameters like PY report name, report class. This is name of the report definition. This is class name of the report definition. This is the page and parameter page and other details. But here we are not provided with an option like how many records we have to pull from the respective report definition while we are invoking from the activity. So if you take a report definition, for example, this one under data access, we can see here maximum number of records to retrieve is 500 which is default one but this particular setting is not available as a parameter in our OOTB activity for that the tip is go here and do obj open as we know that all the report definition lies in this class rule obj report definition in that you see all the instances for example this is a class and here you have all the instances right open the respective report definition that you want and copy pv class name and pv stream name pv stream name is nothing but the report definition name and this is the class name where this particular report definition is saved get those values under a particular step page and you do a property set to that particular step page For this property report info dot this is a step page name report info dot pyua dot py max records and set some parameter after that you set all the parameters that are required to call this particular activity such that it will invoke report definition from an activity and here is the valuable tip of passing maximum records count have a try on this and comment your feedback on this video Hope you have learnt a new tip. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching this video. Please share, like and comment your feedback and stay tuned to this channel.